I haven't vlogged anything or uploaded anything for a while. Well, I have vlogged. I have vlogged, definitely, um, but I haven't uploaded anything. I just wanted to apologise for that. Um, I'm getting married in like two weeks' time, so life is a bit hectic at the minute um, with work and organising everything that needs to happen to get married and stuff. So, I thought I'd just say a quick apology at the start of one of my videos that I'm putting out. Like, these videos have been recorded ages ago and uh, I need to sit down but these videos have been recorded ages ago and I haven't uploaded them because it's taken so long to actually find the time to uh, edit them and do stuff like that like videos like that take a while to edit and um, you know client work sometimes takes priority over my vlogs and some good news if you want to check out these vlogs more often and you want to continue seeing these vlogs make sure you subscribe to the channel in the description below which is my second channel where i'll be putting up different vlogs like this not like the normal design vlogs sort of like a day in the life vlog type kind of thing after we're married there will definitely be more vlogs um coming up i don't know if we'll do them on a weekly basis but i don't want to schedule these sorts of things but if you do enjoy it leave a like in the description leave a like in the description leave a like uh, and a comment because you know i want uh, i want to know if you guys actually enjoy these things and if i've wasted money on a camera that i don't need which i don't think i have um because it's a sick camera and I use it for my instagram posts anyway i can rant as much as anyone so i'm gonna just let you watch the rest of this video thank you so much and yeah have fun locking yourself out of your flat isn't the best thing Basically I went to Weatherspoons and at some point before that when I closed my door I locked myself, no I locked it and then I left the keys in the door, never the best thing. Waiting for Naomi now to come and hand me my keys, Naomi found the keys when she was dropping stuff off. It could be slightly awkward um, and it's quite cold as well. I hope she hurries up. <laughs> I freaked myself out. I was doing my work in Weatherspoons. It's a Saturday, I know, but doing my work in Weatherspoons and I had to lock myself out of my flat. Hopefully, Naomi's coming now. I just got a text, I think, so. In other news, apparently the Queen is coming to my town. So, like, I don't know what to do. I've been asking about or even went into Weatherspoons and asked them, when is the Queen arriving? I'm so not with the times. Apparently, she's coming down and all the army people are getting ready, you know drinking the drinks and all that and whatever spoons and I was just sat there getting really confused and then I remember the Queen is coming to Richmond I don't know what she's doing I think she's looking at a parade or something I might have to read a bit more info I should know so the whole town is manic there's so many people in the center I, I was gonna go in there and get something from WH Smith but in doing that I probably would get annoyed at so many people in the town so I'm not gonna bother if you use a Copic brush marker, don't fill it up the way that I do it. It went absolutely everywhere. It went all over me and then even worse, I went into the bathroom um, and got some like terps or whatever that horrible paint lifter is and I put it on my hands and it killed my hands. It's made it all dry and horrible um, and I spilt a lot of it on the floor and Naomi won't know because I cleaned it up until she watches it, she won't know. So, I'm just trying to work out how to get this off my hands before tomorrow or before I have to shake someone's hand. Good thing I don't have to shake the Queen's hand, as they say, because that would be a bit awkward of all this on my hands. But yeah, I was filling it up and then I just like, I was like, oh, this has gone really well. I filled it up and there's been no spillages. And then I put it down and I realised, oh, it's gone everywhere. It went all over me. So I had to change my clothes and get rid of my other ones. So be careful when you use Copic markers. It's not like Indian ink. It's horrible ink. I nearly went to a Hindi last night with the people from church and the girls and that. She really enjoyed it. I've got mine next Saturday. Not my Hindu, but my stag do with the rest of the guys at church. Because obviously you've seen that I went to the stag do in Blackpool with Ed and Harry. Um, I didn't get much footage after that because I was just too tired um, to do anything. So, lol. I've got my hen, not my hen do, my stag do at La Piazza in just up the road there. Looking forward to it, it's only like less than two weeks now, it's less than two weeks. And Naomi's starting to move stuff in and I'm getting a bit on edge about that. Don't know what she's going to move in. Maybe it'd been easier if we both moved in together. But we've got a nice flat so it doesn't really matter. Here's my door to the flat. 
Those are the stairs to the flat. And then now I'm just waiting for it to sort of arrive. Hopefully she hurries up. Can you hear the bells? Yes, you can. I can also hear rustling. That is Naomi. I was, she was saying she was nesting. Um, she's cleaning up the whole flat and making it livable for her. She's been doing these tiny things that I wouldn't expect her to do, such as this. Put a flat, I don't know if you can see that, hang on. She's been putting this little heart on the window. And she's even gone to the bother of making me a memorial for my marriage. Like, when I become married, Joe, till death do us part. I think she's getting annoyed at me for saying this, but look at that. This is the memorial. <laughs> no, Naomi, I'm kidding. I'm only joking, Naomi. Are you crying? Do they upset you? What? I thought I upset Naomi there for a second. She's all right. She's just going through everything and telling me how much Are of a you disgusting man. Subscribers, your lovely flat. I am Naomi. What do you have to say about the fact that you're tearing apart? I'm making it look pretty. Well, that's my job. But we've completed the stuff. So Naomi's moving everything in. It looks pretty messy on the table at the minute. Um, but we're going to be sorting it all out, I guess. Well, Naomi is going to be sorting it out just now. And, um, yeah, I'm just leaving it to it. Because if I do anything... Interfere? Or, if I interfere, then she's going to be mad. And, yeah. She's telling me what to touch, what not to touch. And she's even telling me to, like... Not put salt and pepper shakers on a cupboard. Not put salt and pepper shakers on a cupboard. But she's making me move stuff away from the flat. She's like, do we need this? Yes, we do. It's a gift. We need that. But she's making me get rid of all these things. You're heartless. So, I know the flat's always looking nice when Naomi's here. Because she's always coming in and doing something and bringing things in. But it looks more like home now, I guess. But I think Naomi gets weirded out about the amount of stuff that I want to keep in the flat as well. Is this correct, Naomi? Yeah. In other news, the Queen is in town. And she is, I don't know what she's doing. What's she doing, Naomi? She's going to see some of the soldiers in the castle. That's some, why the bells are ringing. That's why the bells are ringing. She's going to go and see some of the soldiers in the castle. And also today, I think, it's a, is it a granddaughter? Oh yeah, the princess has just been born. The princess has just been born. I found out a couple hours ago from Naomi. She, she follows these types of things. I wish these bells would shut up. Um, doesn't look likely that they will. So I might just have to end this here. But this is the flat at the minute. You absolutely love it. Naomi's clearing everything away. And I'm going to do some lettering, I think. Unless Naomi... Wow, it's a lot of bags. Uh, unless Naomi wants me to do something else, like clean the flat, which I don't think she does. She's just taken my collection of bin bags out, which I like to collect. Those are going to church. Those are going to church. They're going to go get saved. Anyway, this is it. Help me. Pray for me. Um, high stress. On Saturdays, I was not expecting this, but like, I should be really. I'm getting married in like two weeks. So, hopefully it doesn't last too long. They're just going to be is, Yeah, no, they won't. The thing, pray for both of us, everyone. We need it. Uh, she needs it because I like to hoard stuff. Um, and I like to keep all my gear around. Wait, Nearly, there's one single bell going. Not anymore. Not anymore. That's the bells done. So, yeah, um, that is it. This is the update on the flat. I'll let you know what it looks like when we finish everything off, I guess. You look very confused. Thinking. Yeah, me thinking everyone. This is never good. Help, help me.